Uh, next question is from Jay Spees, Channel All Star on YouTube. Uh, what do you mean by capturing, quote unquote, capturing CO2 on the fermentation side? Or in referring to, uh, to a, a video. I had the idea of running a line from the blow off tube of a late fermentation FV once it has passed high croissant to the bottom inlet of a clean and sanitized bright tank and letting it go for a day, effectively scrubbing the tank of O2 using free CO2 from this fermentation of a similar beer. Is that what you mean or something else? Uh, what I meant to be saying was is uh, bunging or spoonding uh, that uh, fermenting beer. Um, that was that was what I was referring to there. But I do know that there's people that do that, man. And it's and it's it's it's. Uh, I get it. I don't know. And listen, dude, this is Jay. This is just one of those things where like this isn't judgmental. I don't. Sometimes we just do things we're comfortable with. I don't think I can. I don't think I can do that. And I can't exactly tell you why. Okay, this is this is a gut. Like, I I don't know. I, I don't know. Like maybe if if there is a way, like there's an inline, if there's an inline sterile filter between it, like I could I could get down with it. But I'm not saying it would be a problem if you did that either. It's just not, I don't know. It's just outside my comfort, my comfort zone. Um, I, pr I think you could probably displace all of all of the atmosphere in that bright tank uh, if, if you caught the fermentation at the right time, right? Um, so yeah, and maybe it's just me being, you know, namby-pamby, like crazy about... Uh, sanitation and just not understanding things which is always very possible right um so <laughs> Sriva says that that volume was uh a little over four barrels in your weird american volumes you better believe it Srivas. listen man let me know you've got the uh if if uh let me know, man. I want to come. I'll come out there and try those beers. You're, uh, you're, you're across an ocean. I don't like flying over. I don't like flying. Period. But, uh, but anyways, OBP. I hope that helps, man. Uh, I hope that helps. Shreedas, thank you for uh, doing that. So I would say those those fermenters that you have, OB or the that bright tank OBP. I think you could probably do five psi through the bottom of the tank. So you do want to blow some CO2 through your carb stone because you want to clear that too, but then hook up to the bottom of the tank and purge five PSI for probably about a half hour. And that'll get you in a much better space, I think. Uh, <laughs> Andrew, don't start breaking my brain with these numbers. All right. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching. If you feel as if you got any value out of the video, please like and subscribe. There are also other videos that you can watch. They're going to maybe be over here or over here. Appreciate you watching.